Good morning, guys. I hope you're having an awesome start to the week. So we have just entered into week eight of the eight week challenge. Now, this is a very important video because I want to make sure we do everything we can to have the best pictures possible at the end of the week. So there are three things I want you to take note of before you take your last pictures um, and your last measurements. So the first one is within um, a day or two of taking your last picture. I want you to make sure that you keep your carbohydrate intake very, very little, if any. So if you're not too sure, if you're not 100% sure on what carbs are, um, then just let me know, okay? But things like bread, potatoes, rice, fruit, um, honey, any junk food, you just wanna make sure that you're limiting any carbohydrate intake for the next, or a day or two before your last picture. So if you're taking your last set of pictures on Friday, then I'd suggest on Wednesday, Thursday, you keep your carb intake very, very low. Now, the reason why I want to keep it very low is because I want to make sure your tummy is nice and flat. I want to make sure that your body isn't holding, holding on to water. Um, with, the carb, with your carb intake really low, your, um, ability, your body's ability to hold on to water is very little. So um, I want to make sure that you're limiting carbs a day or two before your last pictures. Um, the other thing I want you to do, let's say, for example, you're doing your last pictures on Thursday or Friday, then make sure that you don't train, you don't train super hard within a day or two before those pictures. So if you're going to take your pictures on Friday, make sure that by um, Tuesday latest is your last hard workout. The Wednesday, Thursday, before the Friday pictures, you want to keep it a low intensity. Make sure that your body's not super tired. Um, if your body is under stress or um, if you have trained super hard, uh, your body will be inflamed, it's going to hold on to a bit of water, it's not going to be an accurate measurement, accurate measure of your weight or your um, centimeters if you have trained super hard the day before a picture. So um, just like your carb intake, a day or two before your last pictures, keep your training intensity very low um, so to make sure that you're not inflaming your body to hold on to water. Okay, so those are the first two things. The first one, keep your carb intake low. The second thing is a day or two before your last pictures, keep your training intensity low as well. So that means don't go for personal bests, don't go um, gung-ho and really smash yourself. Just train at a super light intensity, you wanna have a productive workout, a gentle sweat, but nothing super hard, super intense. The hard work has been done already, that you would have been done over the last six or seven weeks. You would have trained super hard. Up until now, we're just sort of doing what we need to do to make sure your pictures at the end of this week are accurate. Um, and that I'm trying to just help you just get into um, the best shape possible before the end of the week. So carbs low, training intensity low before pictures. You know, the last thing I want you to do, um, the last pictures that you take, I want them to be done first thing in the morning as you wake up. So as you get out of bed in the morning, make sure you take your pictures in the same clothing as possible. If not, that's not the end of the world. Just make sure that you've done your last pictures uh, first thing in the morning as you wake up. Your hydration level, your body would have been lying horizontal and then your, your hydration will have been better and your tummy will be nice and flat. Um, so it just shows that your, your pictures will be better um, at first thing in the morning as opposed to at the end of the day. So just remember those three things and uh, your pictures should be a lot better than they were before if you've been doing the work, if you've been consistent in this challenge. Um, so the mini challenge for this week is just to pay, to pay attention to those details and then obviously just to um, enjoy the rest of the week. There will be a prize giving this uh, Saturday. I'll be announcing the winner. So I want to make sure that you guys send in your pictures on Thursday or Friday latest. Um, and then your measurements Thursday or Friday latest as well. Okay. Um, I, hope that you, I really hope that you guys have enjoyed this challenge um, as much as I have. I've, I've enjoyed seeing everyone getting stuck in. I've enjoyed seeing the Gies. Um, everybody, you know, um, probably messaging me about the, the challenge, enjoying the workouts, enjoying the challenge. Um, making new friends along the way. It's been really, really awesome for me. So um, at the end of this video, I just wanted to also mention that if you were keen to do uh, part two, a second eight week challenge, I'm more than happy to do that. Um, uh, if you are keen to do another challenge with me, uh, there, I know there's about three or four people that have already told me that, that they'd like to continue just a second, a second eight week block, just to continue the momentum. I'm more than happy to do that. I'll create a second group for that. And let's just keep you going. Um, just let me know. Um, I'm more than happy to chat to you and we can you know, plan from there and create a, a custom plan. I also want to mention that the second block 
of eight week of the eight week challenge will be very different to this block. This block, you've had a certain training technique, certain training philosophy um, and angle. And the second uh, eight week block, we're going to have a different training um, idea, different training um, stimulus. It'll be a very different um, way of approaching your health, and there'll be a bigger focus on nutrition. So, if you are keen to get stuck into phase or uh, the eight week challenge phase two, then let me know and we can get you going. I'll create the second group so long and then I'll just plug you in there. But for the meantime, right now, finish this week well. Make sure that you do this challenge. Uh, you know, you, you owe it to yourself to finish the week off well. So pay attention to the things I've, I've said in this video. Make sure that you get the best pictures possible. Send those pictures through to me so I can compare them and I can send you the before and afters. Um, if I don't have your before picture, then take your second picture, put them together and send them through to me if you want to. But I'd like you to do that um, so that you can see the difference between and you can see what's possible in eight weeks. Um, and if you, for any of you that can see a difference in eight weeks, just imagine what you can do in the next six to 12 months. There's so many different things to do. What we've done in the, in the last eight weeks has just been scratching the surface. There's, there's so many different variations to help your body lose weight. And if you, have, if you haven't seen any weight loss, if you haven't seen a big difference in each picture, then let me know and I can help you figure out, figure out why there hasn't been a change. That's what I do. But um, guys, good luck this week. Give it horns and I'll talk to you later this week.